Have you ever tried to create a toolbar in your Android app only to find that your buttons just won't align the way you want them to? It's frustrating, right? If that's you, then you're in the right place. Today, we're diving into how to add buttons to your toolbar programmatically and troubleshoot alignment issues. I totally get it. You want your toolbar to look just right, but sometimes the code just doesn't cooperate. You're not alone in this struggle. Many developers face similar challenges when working with toolbars in Android. Here's the specific situation we're looking at. One user recently asked, how can I create a toolbar programmatically and align my buttons correctly? They shared their code, but the buttons just wouldn't align to the right as intended. Sound familiar? Let's dig into this together and find a solution. So what could be causing this alignment issue? When adding views to a toolbar, the layout parameters play a crucial role in how they are displayed we'll break down the code and identify what might be going wrong. And don't go anywhere. I've got a handy tip at the end that will help you avoid these alignment headaches in the future. To begin solving the user's issue with button alignment in the toolbar, we need to ensure that the toolbar is set up correctly. First, the user should create a new toolbar instance and set its properties. Next, the user should add the button to the toolbar. However, to achieve the desired alignment, we need to use a different layout parameter. Instead of linear layout, we will use a toolbar layout params. After adding the button with the correct layout parameters, the user should ensure that the toolbar is added to the activities layout. This is crucial for the button to be displayed properly. Finally, the user should test the application to verify that the button is now aligned to the right side of the toolbar as intended. This can be done by running the application on an emulator or a physical device. Fun fact, did you know that the first Android version was released in 2008? We've come a long way since then, but some issues still feel like they belong to the early days. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution from a user suggests ensuring you use androidx.appcompat.widget.toolbar.layoutparams when adding views programmatically. They found that using toolbar.layoutparams led to issues because it resolved to android.widget.toolbar.layoutparams instead. This caused problems with gravity settings, as no exceptions were thrown when incorrect layout parameters were used. Let's take a look at an answer from another user. An alternative approach shared by another user involves adding a switch button directly within the toolbar. They suggest using XML to define the toolbar and the switch button, setting the layout parameters to ensure proper alignment. Here's the tip I promised. Always use the appropriate layout parameters for the container you're working with. This simple habit can save you a lot of time and frustration. And there you have it. Your buttons should now align perfectly in your toolbar. Remember, using the right layout parameters is key. If you found this helpful, hit the subscribe button for more tips. And don't miss our next video where we tackle more Android development challenges.